New conversation. Hello, my name is Michael. I just arrived and I'm so excited. Hi, Michael. My name is Mary. Have you just moved here? Yes, Mary. My family and I moved to the city a few weeks ago. Change is always exciting. I hope you have a good time here. Thank you, Mary. I hope to make new friends. I can definitely be your friend. I can also introduce you to our classmate. Really? It helps a lot. Of course, everyone helps each other in this lesson. What is your favorite lesson? I actually love math. What is it about you? My favorite subject is science. I love learning new things about nature. I also like science. Maybe we can work together. Of course, why not? Thus, we can be successful in both science and mathematics lessons together. Great plan, Mary. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Michael. We love helping each other, so let me know if you need help. That's a very nice gesture, Mary. I am very happy that we are friends. I'm happy to be friends with you too, Michael. See you tomorrow at school. Yes, see you at school tomorrow. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? Good morning, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm great, thank you. Did you have a chance to review the project proposal? Yes, I did. It looks good overall, but there are a few points I'd like to discuss. Sure, let's skip them. What concerns do you have? First of all, the timeline seems a bit cramped. Can we extend the deadline for a week? This is a valid point. I'll talk to the team and see if we can make adjustments. Great. Secondly, I noticed some inconsistencies in the budget section. Can you specify which parts need clarification? Sure. On page 3, under hardware costs. The numbers don't match. I see this now. Thanks for catching this. I will fix it right away. You're welcome finally. Do we have a backup plan in case of technical problems? Yes we do. We have a contingency plan for such situations. Great. This is reassuring. How is the team's progress on coding tasks? They are making good progress and we are well on our way to reaching our milestones. Good to hear. Let's be careful to keep communication between teams open. Acceptance. Communication is key to the success of this project. By the way, have we scheduled the client meeting for next week? Yes, it's set to 10 o'clock on Tuesday. I will send the invitations today. Perfect. Until then, I will prepare the presentation materials. Thanks Mary. You are doing a great job managing this project. Thank you Michael. It's a team effort and I appreciate your support. Teamwork is absolutely essential for our success. Anything else to discuss? Not now. Let's continue to monitor our progress and resolve issues promptly. Acceptance. Thanks Mary for the fruitful discussion. Thank you too Michael. Have a nice day. You too, Mary. Goodbye for now. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you in the morning? Hello John. I am good, and you? I am also good thank you. How was the meeting last night? The meeting went well but there are still some issues to be resolved. I understand shall we discuss these issues today? Of course this is a good idea. We can meet in the afternoon. Great, what time does he wake up in the afternoon? 2 p.m. would be fine for me. How is it for you? Worn at 2, okay. Shall we meet in the meeting room? 
Yes, a meeting room would be appropriate. Also, don't forget to submit a report. You're right, I'm sending the reports now. Here are the reports. Thanks John. Now I'm back to work. I wish you good work, Mary. Good job to you too, John. See you later. See you bye. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How are you today? I am good thanks. All right and you? I am also good. What brings you to the market today? I need to buy food weekly. All right and you? Same way. I need to buy a few things. Great. Let's go inside together. It looks like a plan. What's on your shopping list? I need some milk, eggs, bread and vegetables. I'm looking for chicken, rice and pasta. Let's start with the dairy section. Of course. Do you prefer low fat or full fat milk? I prefer the low fat one. All right and you? I'll have whole milk. Now let's get some eggs. Need a dozen eggs? Yes please. I'll also have some white bread. I prefer whole wheat bread. Shall we meet at the checkout? Sure, but I still need to get some tomatoes and lettuce. I'll go find the chicken. See you at the checkout. Thanks Mary. See you there. New conversation. Hello, I'm Michael. Pleased to meet you. Hi Michael, I'm Mary. Nice to meet you too. Are you excited for the trip? Yes it is me. I'm flying for the first time. Don't worry, it's safe. Did you pack everything? I think so too. I double checked my luggage. Great. Where are you going? I'm going to New York for a business meeting. This sounds interesting. I am visiting my friends there. Have you been to New York before? Yes, several times. Wonderful city. I can't wait to explore. Are you traveling alone for the first time? Yes, I usually travel with my family. You will be fine. Flight attendants are helpful. Thank you, that's reassuring. How long is your flight? About a four-hour flight. This is not so bad. Bring a book or watch a movie. I packed my Kindle so I have a lot to read. Smart choice. I brought my tablet too. Do you have travel tips? Don't get dehydrated and try to sleep on the plane. I will keep it in mind. Oh, here comes the flight attendant. Hello, can we have some water please? Thank you. So Michael, what do you do for a living? I am a software developer. All right, and you? I work in the marketing department of a technology company. Very cool. We have similar interests. Yes, technology is fascinating. It's time to fasten our seat belts. Plane is leaving. Here we go. I hope it will be a smooth flight. Don't worry, we are in good hands. Driving pleasure. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Have you had a chance to look at the software project we mentioned? Yes I did. It looks promising but we need to fix a few issues. I agree. What are your thoughts on the timeline? I think we should aim to complete it in three months. This seems logical. Let's allocate resources accordingly. Great. I will assign tasks to our team members. Speaking of team, do you think we need additional members? I believe our staff is insufficient. We should consider hiring another developer. Okay then let's start the recruitment process. We also need to provide effective communication between the team. Acceptance. Regular meetings will help with this. 
and we must document the progress of the project. Yes, documentation is very important. We don't want any misunderstanding. Definitely. Let's set up a meeting with the team to discuss these points. It looks like a plan. I'll set the meeting for this afternoon. Thanks Michael. Let's make this project a success. Definitely Mary. Together we can achieve great results. New conversation. Hello my name is Michael. Hello Michael. My name is Mary. Nice to meet you, Mary. I'm glad too, Michael. What grade are you in? I'm in second grade. What grade are you in? I'm in second grade too. Really? Then we are in the same class. Yes like that. So which lesson do you like the most? I like the painting class the most all right and you? I like math class. Ah, I don't really understand the math. Maybe I can help you? Really? I would be very pleased. Of course why not? When can we start? We can start from tomorrow. Great. So what is your favorite activity? I like drawing the most. Maybe you can teach me too? Certainly. Drawing is so much fun. It would be great. Then one day we will draw. Yes, I'm looking forward to it. So what is your favorite game? I like to play hide and seek. I also like hide and seek. Then maybe one day we can play hide and seek together. We are definitely having a lot of fun. So what kind of books do you like to read? I love adventure books the most. My favorite adventure books. Then we can start a book club together. This is a good idea. I thought so too. When can we have our first date after school? We can do it on Monday next week. This is great. Then see you Monday. Yes, I'm looking forward to it. Me too, Michael. Then I'll see you at school tomorrow, Mary. See you at school tomorrow, Michael. Good day, Mary. Good day, Michael. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How is everything going? Good morning, Michael. Things are going well. I'm working on the software requirements. That's great to hear. Have you made any progress? Yes, I've outlined the basic requirements, but I need your feedback on a few issues. Of course, I'd be happy to help. What do you want? First of all, I need to know the target audience of this software. Our target audience is primarily small businesses. I understand next, I need clarification on the budget for this project. We have a $100,000 budget for development. Perfect. Now let's discuss the timeline. What is our deadline? We should have a working prototype within three months. Three months. Okay. I will make sure to make my plan accordingly. Great. Let's move on to the features. What are the must-haves? We need user authentication, data storage and reporting capabilities. What about good things to have? It would be nice to have integration with third-party tools and mobile access. Okay, let's prioritize the essentials first. Acceptance. I'll start working on the detailed specifications. Great. We should also consider scalability for future growth. Yes, we will design the architecture with scalability in mind. Is there anything else we should discuss? Yes, we should hold regular progress meetings to keep track of our milestones. Good idea. How about a weekly status update meeting? Weekly sounds good. I'll schedule our first meeting for next Monday. It looks like a plan. Thanks Mary. Thank you Michael. I'll start with the requirements document. Perfect. 
Let's make this project a success. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you feeling? Hi Michael. To be honest, I'm a little nervous. Don't worry, Mary. Doctors here are very good. What does the problem look like? I've had a headache for the past two days and it's getting worse and worse. That doesn't sound very good. Haven't you seen a doctor yet? Yes, this morning doctor I saw Smith. He said I might need some tests. Anyway, I hope it's nothing serious. Is there anything I can do to help? Thank you Michael. Just having you here is comforting. You're welcome, Mary. We are friends and friends support each other. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How are you today? I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Are you ready for the project meeting? Yes, I set the agenda. Great, let's start the meeting. First, let's review the project timeline. Okay go on. We are moving towards the deadline. Good to hear. However, there are some challenges ahead. What kind of difficulties? We need more resources for testing. I will discuss this with our. Thanks, this will be very helpful. What's next on the agenda? Let's discuss the budget. Are we on budget? We're a little over budget. We need to find ways to reduce costs. I agree, we can optimize our expenses. Let's also talk about customer feedback. They want some UI improvements. I will inform the development team. Good, we also have to consider security. Definitely, this is one of the top priorities. Anything else to add? Let's schedule a demo for next week. I will coordinate with the team. Thank you Mary. Thank you Michael. That's it for today's meeting. See you in the demo, Michael. I'm looking forward to it. New conversation. Hey, what are you planning to do this summer vacation? I haven't planned my vacation yet. What are you doing? I'm thinking of going to summer school. Really? Which course are you planning to take? I need to take an English lesson here. I need to improve my language. Great. I also want to learn something. What level are you at? I am currently at A2 level. Which course do you think I should take? A language course for A2 level may be a good option. You can practice speaking and meet new people. Good idea. Can you recommend a language school? Surely there are several good language schools here. I can give you some suggestions. Thank you. Also, what do you plan to do after graduation? I haven't decided yet, but I want to advance in my career. Maybe I'll graduate. Getting a master's degree is a great idea. In which field would you like to progress? I plan to concentrate on an area such as business management or marketing. Good luck. Finally, which city will you be in this summer? I currently live in Boston and will spend my summer vacation here. You can have a great time in Boston. I'm also considering a few places to vacation. Let me know if you make your vacation plans. Maybe we can do something together. New conversation. Hey, do you know where the school library is? Of course, on the second floor of the main building. Thanks a lot. I need to return some books. No problem. Are you new here? Yes, I just started this semester. By the way, my name is Sarah. Nice to meet you Sarah. Alex. If you have any questions about the campus, feel free to ask. Thanks Alex. I can accept this offer. I'm still trying to find my way. 
Don't worry, I was in the same boat when I first came here. You will understand. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you today? I'm fine like that, thanks. All right and you? I am also good. Are you ready for the meeting? Yes, I prepared the presentation. Great. Let's start then. First, let's review the project objectives. Sure go ahead. Our main goal is to improve the user experience. This is important. How can we do this? We can simplify the user interface. Good idea. What else? We should also fix bug issues. Acceptance. Anything else on the agenda? Yes, we need to discuss the timeline. Let's set exact dates. How about completing it by next month? Sounds reasonable. Let's aim for that. We also need to allocate resources. True, we will need more developers. I will start recruiting new team members. Thanks Mary. You are always very proactive. Teamwork is very important for success. We definitely make a great team. Shall we talk about the budget now? Yes, let's allocate resources to this project. I will prepare a detailed budget proposal. Make sure it's affordable. I will keep it in mind. Have you thought about the technical aspects? Yes, we need to upgrade our servers. Let's get IT involved. I will contact them after the meeting. Thanks Mary. Do you have anything else in mind? We should also prioritize features. Which are the most critical? User registration and data security. These are actually very important. Is there anything you want to add? Let's focus on a mobile-friendly design. I get it, we'll make it sensitive. How about marketing the product? We can discuss this later. Good point, let's stick to the plan. I will create a project timeline. Add milestones and tasks. It will help us stay organized. What is our estimated budget? I will calculate according to our plan. Keep it within a reasonable range. Of course, we don't want to spend too much. What about our competitors? We need to analyze their strategy. I'll assign someone to do this. Excellent. That will give us the idea. Let's make a checklist for the team. I will create one and share it. Communication is important here. I'll make sure everyone stays up to date. This is crucial to the success of the project. Then we are on the same page. Let's also consider the risks. I will identify potential difficulties. We must have a backup plan. I agree, we will be well prepared. Time management is essential. I will highlight this to the team. How is customer feedback? We must collect regularly. It helps us make improvements. Our goal is customer satisfaction. Also, let's have regular meetings. Weekly updates sound good? Yes, that's a good frequency. I will program them accordingly. Any other concerns, Mary? We must ensure data privacy. Let's definitely prioritize. Compliance is a must. We will follow all the rules. Our legal team can help with this. Let's include them right away. I will inform them after the meeting. Thanks for taking care of it. It's all part of the job. You are doing a great job. Thank you Michael. Team effort. Teamwork makes dreams come true. We will make this project a success. Together we can achieve anything. Let's get our A game, Michael. I am fully present, Mary. Let's do this. That's the spirit. Let's work. It's time to turn our plans into reality. 
I will send the meeting minutes. Great, it will help everyone stay on track. Anything else before I finish? No, I think we've told them all. Okay, let's postpone the meeting then. Thanks for your dedication, Mary. And thank you, Michael. Have a nice day. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How is it going? Hi, Michael. I'm fine. Thanks. All right, and you? Not bad. Thanks for asking. Are you busy with work? Oh, yeah. It's been pretty hectic lately. How's your business? He was too busy. The new project takes a lot of my time. I had heard of it. Is it going well? It is difficult, but we are making progress. How is your family? Good, thanks. My daughter just started college. Time flies, right? My son is also in college. Really? How did you like it? He seems to be enjoying it, making new friends and stuff. That's great to hear. Let's order our drinks, shall we? Definitely, I need a nice drink right now. What will it be for you, Michael? I'll have a whiskey, please. I'll go with a glass of white wine. Cheers. Cheers, Mary. Here to catch up and relax. New conversation. Hello, Miriam. How are you today? I'm fine, Michael. Thanks for asking. All right, and you? I am also good. Therefore, we need to talk about the issue in the software project. Yes, I noticed a problem with the login page. Really? What does the problem look like? The login button sometimes doesn't work. This is not good. We must fix it as soon as possible. I agree. It affects the user experience. Any ideas on what could be causing this? I think it might be a coding error. Okay, let's explore this. Can you show me the code? Cut it here. Hmm, I see a syntax error here. Oh my fault. I will fix it right away. Great, let's run some tests after we fix the problem. Yes, we should definitely test it thoroughly. If everything looks good, we can deploy the update. Looks like a plan, Michael. Thanks for catching this thread, Mary. It's okay, Michael. Teamwork makes dreams come true. Definitely. Let's work this out together. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How is everything going? Hello, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Have you been busy at work lately? Oh, you know how. Always busy. All right, and you? Do you have big projects? Yes, we are working on a new client proposal. Pretty tough. This sounds interesting. Can I buy you a drink? Sure. I'll have a beer, please. Great. I'll have a glass of wine. Thanks. So, have you traveled anywhere recently? Not anytime soon, but I'm planning a trip to Europe next month. Europe? Sounds great. Do you have specific places in mind? I will start from Paris and visit a few more cities. Paris is beautiful. I went there last year. Don't miss the Eiffel Tower. I won't. By the way, how is your family? They're doing well, thanks for asking. What about yours? Everybody is fine. My son has just graduated from university. We congratulate him. This is a great success. Thank you. It was a journey. Time really flies, right? It certainly is. So do you have any plans for the weekend? Let's get some rest. Maybe watch a movie. All right, and you? I'm going for a walk with my friends on Saturday. Seems like a great way to spend the weekend. It should be fun. We love the outdoors. Enjoy your walk, Mary. Thanks, Michael. 
Enjoy your movie night too. We'll make. See you again soon. Definitely. Good evening. You too, Mary. Bye. Bye bye Michael. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Did you have a good weekend? Yes I did. I went to the park with my family. All right and you? I had a relaxing weekend at home. So, Mary, have you finished the meeting's report? Not yet. I'm almost done. I need more time. No problem. Take your time, but try to finish it by tomorrow morning if possible. I will do my best to have it ready by then. Great. By the way, have you heard about the new project we're starting next month? Yes I did. Sounds exciting. Are you leading this project? Yes it is me. I want you to be part of the team. Would you be interested? Definitely Michael. I would love to take part in the new project. Wonderful. I think your expertise will be a valuable asset to the team. Thank you Michael. I'm looking forward to this. Is there anything special I need to prepare for the project? Today I will send you the details and the meeting invitation. Just be prepared to discuss your ideas. Sounds good. I will take care of your email. Great. Let's meet again later this week to review the project in more detail. Of course Michael. I'll be ready for our meeting. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm great, thank you. Are you ready for our training? Definitely. Let's start with some stretching exercises. Sounds good. I'll take the exercise mat. I'll take the dumbbells. We can lift some light weights. Perfect. After that we can use the treadmill. Sure. I'll set it to medium tempo. This works for me. By the way, have you seen the new elliptical machine? Yes, it's right there. Let's try later. Good idea. It will be a nice change. Did you remember to bring your water bottle before we started? Yes, it's in my gym bag. Hydration is important. Definitely, especially during our training. Let's start with some warm-up exercises, shall we? Yes, let's start by jumping. Okay, I'll count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Front. Now let's move on to the moves. Right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Front. We are ready to start our training. Let's do this, Mary. We have this. Definitely Michael. We will stay fit and healthy. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you today? Hi Michael. I'm fine like that, thanks. Alright and you? I am also good. We've had a busy week at work. I can guess. What are you doing? I am a manager at a technology company. All right, and you? What is your business? I'm a teacher at the local school. It's quite rewarding. That sounds good. Do you come to this bar often? Not exactly. First time here. What about you? Sometimes I come here to relax. They have good drinks. I understand. Can I buy you a drink? You are very kind. Let me have a beer, please. Sure, I'll get you a beer. Cheers. Cheers. So what do you do for fun in your free time? I enjoy reading and walking. All right, and you? I like to play golf and watch sports on TV. Golf sounds fun. Maybe I should try it sometime. You are your property. A great way to relax and enjoy nature. I'll think about it.
Thanks for your suggestion. You're welcome. So do you have family in town? Yes, I have a son and a daughter. They keep me busy. This is great. Family is important. Definitely. All right, and you? Do you have family? Yes, I am also married and have two children. It seems like we have a lot in common. Really it is. It was nice chatting with you, Mary. Likewise with Michael. Enjoy your drink. New conversation. Hey Mary, when do you want to go to the movies? Hmm, maybe we'll go tonight. Which movie would you like to watch? I'm thinking of watching a comedy or a romantic movie. What are you thinking? I love both. You choose. Okay, let's watch a romantic movie then. Great. Which session do you prefer? Do you think a session at 20 in the morning would be good? Okay, let's go to the 8 a.m. session. I'll get the tickets. Thank you, Michael. Shall we get some popcorn and soda? Of course not without popcorn and soda at the cinema. When are we supposed to be there? The movie will start at 8 a.m., so we need to be there at least 20 minutes before. I understand let's make a plan for the evening. I don't like to wait so it's better to go early. You are right. I've been waiting to see this movie for a long time. Me too. Looks like it'll be fun tonight. Yes, does it get hot for you? Definitely. I can't wait to spend time with a good movie and a great friend. That's right Michael. Thank you for inviting me tonight. You're welcome, Mary. Good thing we are friends. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you today? Hello Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. We've had a busy week at work. I know what you mean. It's been intense for me too. Let's relax a little. How about a drink at the bar? This sounds like a great idea. What would you like? Let me have a beer, please. Of course I'll have a glass of wine. Mary, have you taken any trips recently? No, not soon. I was very busy with my job. I understand sometimes it's important to take a break. You are right Michael. Where would you like to travel next? I've always wanted to visit Europe. All right and you? Europe sounds great. I would love to discover Italy. Italy is also on my list we should plan a trip together. It would be great. We can try all the delicious food. In honor of future adventures, Mary. Cheers Michael. To new experiences and great company. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. And you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Let's start the project update, shall we? Sure. Let's dive into the subject. First of all, I would like to talk about our progress in coding tasks. Okay go on. We have completed about 70% of the coding. It goes pretty smoothly. This is great news. Any problems so far? We encountered a few bugs, but the team fixed them right away. Excellent teamwork, Michael. Yes, our developers are doing a great job. Now let's talk about the timeline. So when can we expect the first prototype? I believe we will have it ready for testing by the end of next week. That's great, Michael. Our customer will be satisfied. Speaking of the client, they requested a few changes. Have you reviewed these? Yes I did. They look reasonable. We can accommodate these changes. Excellent. I'll pass this on to the team. Now let's talk about the budget. Are we staying within our budget so far? 
Yes, we are, but we need to closely monitor forward-looking expenditures. I agree, financial discipline is very important. Mary, do you think we should do a mid-project review with the client? I think this is a good idea. We'll keep them updated and included. Great. I will schedule that meeting and prepare the presentation. Thanks Michael. Is there anything else we should be covering today? No, I guess that covers everything for now. Thanks for your contribution, Mary. You're welcome, Michael. Let's keep up the good work. New conversation. Hello Miriam. How are you today? I'm fine like that, thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. Are you ready for our project meeting? Yes, it is me. I prepared some ideas. Great. Let's start. What is your first idea? I think we should prepare a presentation. That sounds good. What should our presentation include? We should cover the project goals and timeline. Acceptance. What else should we add? I also think we should talk about the roles of team members. This is important. Another thing? We should highlight the benefits of the project. Great. Let's work on it. When should we meet again? How about tomorrow afternoon? Sounds good. See you later. See you later, Michael. New conversation. Hello. My name is Michael. Pleased to meet you. Hi Michael, I'm Mary. Same way. So where are you from, Mary? I'm from New York. All right, and you? I'm from Los Angeles. Is this your first time to Los Angeles? Yes, like that. I am excited to explore the city. Flight attendant arrives with drinks. What would you like? Let me have a creamy coffee, please. Do you enjoy flying? Not exactly. I'm a little nervous during takeoff. How long is the flight to Los Angeles? It takes about five hours. It's not too bad. What is the purpose of your trip? I am visiting friends. All right, and you? Are you traveling for business or pleasure? I'm on vacation. I have to take a break from work. I see you have a book there. What are you reading? This is a mystery novel. I love to read on flights. The view from the window is magnificent, isn't it? Yes, especially when above the clouds. I forgot my headphones. Do you have an extra pair? Sorry, I don't have an extra pair. Maybe you can borrow it from the flight attendant. Oh no, I think I forgot my wallet at home. Don't worry, I will help you with any expenses during the journey. I can't wait to try the local food in Los Angeles. Me too. I heard there are great restaurants here. I hope our luggage arrives safely. Yes, let's hope so. Losing luggage can be a big problem. Look at that beautiful sunset outside the window. Stunning. I'm glad we have a seat by the window. I need to fill out the customs form soon. That's right, mine is ready too. However, it's a bit confusing. Do you have any plans for your first day in Los Angeles? Not yet. I'll probably get some rest and settle in. What is your favorite part of traveling? I love experiencing different cultures and meeting new people. We must share contact information. Maybe we can meet in Los Angeles. This seems like a great idea, Michael. I hope the weather will be fine in Los Angeles when we land. Yes, it needs to be sunny and warm. Perfect. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you? I'm fine like that, thanks. And you? What lessons do you have today? I have English and math class in the morning. Do you like English lesson? 
Yes, it's interesting. All right, and you? Michael, have you met our new professor? No, not yet. Is he nice? Mary, let's have lunch after class. Sounds great. I'm hungry. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? Not exactly. Maybe I can relax a little. Mary, would you like to study for the exam together? Yes, let's do it. It will be useful. Michael, where are you originally from? I'm from California. All right, and you? Mary, what's your major? I specialize in psychology. All right, and you? Michael, have you been to the campus library? No, I did not. Is it big? Mary, can you help me with this math problem? Of course I will do my best. Michael, let's go to the student center for coffee. I'd love to. Coffee sounds good. Mary, do you have any siblings? Yes, I have a brother. All right, and you? Michael, have you seen that new movie? Not yet, but I want to. Is it good? Mary, what do you do in your free time? I like to read books and listen to music. Michael, let's join the study group. That sounds good. It will help us. Mary, can you recommend a good restaurant? Of course there is a nice Italian restaurant in the city center. Michael, what is your favorite subject? I really enjoy history. Mary, are you going home for the holidays? Yes, I'm going to visit my family in New York. Michael, do you do any sports? I'm playing football with some of my friends. New conversation. Hello Mary, how is it going? Hi Michael, I'm fine, thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. Did you have a good weekend? Yes, it was great. I hung out with some friends. All right, and you? I rested at home and watched movies. It was pretty cold. That sounds good. By the way, do you have any plans for tonight? Not exactly. What's up? There's a new cafe downtown. Wanna check it out with me? Of course, gladly. What time should we meet? How about 7 p.m.? Is this suitable for you? It sounds perfect. I'll see you at 7 o'clock then. Great. See you later, Michael. New conversation. Hello, I'm Michael. How are you today? Hi, Michael. I'm Mary. I'm fine like that, thanks. And you? I am good, thanks. Are you excited for the trip? Yes, it is me. I'm flying for the first time. Don't worry, it's safe to fly. Did you pack everything? I think so too. I have my passport and ticket. Great. This is the most important. Do you have hand luggage? Yes, just this little bag. What about you? I have a backpack and a purse. I am going on holiday. Beautiful. Where are you going? I'm going to Florida to visit my family. All right, and you? I'm going to New York for a business conference. This sounds interesting. How long will you stay in New York? I will be there for three days. How is your journey? I'll be in Florida for a week. Do you have any plans in New York? Yes, I have some meetings and I want to see some places. He looks very busy. I plan to rest on the beach. Do you like the beach? Yes, I love the beach. I hope I can visit one when I'm in New York. You should try to devote some time to this. What do you do for work? I work in marketing. All right, and you? I am a teacher. I teach English to high school students. This is great. I admire teachers. English is very important. Thank you. It can be challenging but rewarding. I can guess. Oh, the plane is about to take off. Yes, here we go. 
Enjoy your trip to New York, Mary. Thanks, Michael. Have a great time in Florida. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How are you? I am good, thanks. How are you? I am also good, thank you. What exercises are you planning to do today? I'm thinking of doing some cardio today. You? I'm thinking of doing weight training too. Great. Maybe we can do cardio together later. Of course with pleasure. What weight training are you doing? Today I will do back and shoulder exercises. Good choice. I'm thinking of focusing on my legs too. How much weight do you use? I currently use 10 pound dumbbells. I use the same weight. You found a good balance. Thank you. I have improved myself over time since I started this business. That's it. You have to keep going and keep going. Definitely. So which cardio workout do you prefer? I usually prefer to run on the treadmill. Sometimes I also like to ride a bike. Cycling is a great cardio workout. Yes, it is both fun and effective. When are you starting? I can start now, is it okay for you? Sure, let's get started. Great, so let's get started. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How are you today? I'm fine like that, thanks. And you? I am also good. What's for breakfast? I made some scrambled eggs and toast. It sounds delicious. Get yourself some coffee. Thanks, I can have a glass. Did you sleep well last night? Not really, I was having trouble falling asleep. Maybe you should try some herbal tea before bed. That sounds good. I'll try tonight. How was work yesterday? I was busy but managed to finish everything. You always work hard. Well, he pays the bills. Speaking of bills, don't forget to pay the rent this week. I will not forget. Did you hear that Sarah is engaged? Yes, I saw it on Facebook. They make a very sweet couple. Yes like that. What are your plans for the weekend? I'm thinking of going for a walk on Saturday. Sounds fun. Can I join you? The more, of course, the merrier. Great. I'll bring some snacks. It looks like a plan. By the way, have you been playing with your guitar lately? Not as much as I want. I was busy with work. You should devote some time to this. Music is relaxing. You are right. I will take it again. Dinner was delicious, Michael. Thanks Mary. I'm glad you liked it. What's for dessert? I made chocolate chip cookies. Very good. Can I get one? Help yourself. These are amazing. Did you use a special recipe? One of my grandma's classics. So it's a family secret? You can say so. Michael, do you remember your trip to the beach last summer? Of course I will never forget. It was a great time. We should plan another trip soon. I would love it. Where should we go next? How about a trip to the mountains? Sounds adventurous. Let us do it. So it's a date. Michael, do you follow the news? Not really, I was very busy. Is something important going on? Yes, a big election is approaching. Ah, I should definitely be aware of that. It is important to vote and have our voices heard. You are right Mary. I'll make sure you sign up. That's the spirit. Mary, do you remember our first date? Of course it was in that cozy little cafe. I was so nervous. Me too. But it turned out to be a great evening. I'm glad we took this chance. Me too, Michael. Mary, I have something important to ask you. What is it, Michael? 
Will you marry me? Oh my God, Michael. Yes, yes, a thousand times yes. I am very happy Mary. I love you very much. I love you too. We will have a beautiful life together. We really will. Michael, let's celebrate with some champagne. Looks like a plan. Cheers to our future. Cheers. Michael, when do you think we should have the wedding? How about next summer? This gives us plenty of time to plan everything. And it will be a beautiful outdoor wedding. I can't wait. Not me either. Michael, we should invite all our friends and family. Definitely, the more the merrier. It will be the wedding of the year. I have no doubt about it. Michael, let's dance. Satisfaction. This is the happiest day of my life. Me too, Mary. I can't believe we're getting married. This is a dream come true. I love you more than words can express. And I love you with all my heart. Forever and always. Forever and always. Michael, let's grow old together. That's the plan, Mary. I couldn't have had it otherwise. Cheers to our love. Cheers. Mary, what is your favorite moment together? There are so many, but our first trip to Paris stands out. Oh yes. The Eiffel Tower and all those croissants. It was like a fairy tale. One day we will have to go back. Definitely, and maybe we should take our children with us. This looks like a plan. Michael, do you remember when we got our first pet? How can I forget? That little puppy stole our hearts. And we named him Max. It has brought so much happiness to our lives. I miss him. I am also Mary. He was a special part of our family. Let's visit his grave this weekend. This is a very good idea. Michael, I'm so grateful for the life you've had together. I am also Mary. I couldn't imagine my life without you. You complete me. And you complete me. Michael for us. For us, Mary. I love you more each day. And I love you more and more. New conversation. Hello Mary. How's it going? Hello Michael. I'm fine like that, thanks. All right and you? I'm great, I'm a little tired from work. I know this feeling. I had a long day too. Yes, working can be tiring sometimes. By the way, have you seen the news about the traffic jam? No, I did not. What happened? A major accident happens on the highway and traffic is locked for miles. It sounds very bad. I'm glad we're on the bus and not stuck in this mess. Definitely. The bus is much more comfortable than sitting in traffic. We can also relax and not worry about driving. True. And it gives us time to chat and catch up. This is true. So how's your new job going? Challenging but exciting. I am learning a lot. That's great to hear. I'm proud of you. Thanks Michael. You are always very supportive. Of course that's what friends are for. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? I'm fine Michael. Thanks for asking. All right and you? Did you complete the report I requested? Yes, I emailed you a few minutes ago. Michael, we have a meeting with the client at 3 in the afternoon. Oh, I forgot that. Let me check my schedule. Mary, can you help me with this spreadsheet? I have a problem. Of course I'll come and have a look. Michael, be sure to submit your expense report by Friday. Thanks for the reminder, Mary. I will do it today. Mary, have you seen my coffee mug? I cannot find. I think it's in the kitchen. 
I saw it there this morning. Michael, the printer is out of paper again. Can you refill? Sure. I'll take care of it right away. Mary, do you know where office supplies are kept? Yes, they're in the supply room at the end of the hall. Michael, the boss wants to see us in his office. I wonder what it's about. Let's go and find out. Mary, will you come to the team's lunch today? Yes, I will be there. What time is it again? New conversation. Hello Mary. How is everything going? Hi Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I am also good. Let's have a drink, shall we? Sure, that sounds great. What's your choice? I will drink a beer. All right and you? Let me have a glass of wine, please. Bartender, a beer and a glass of wine, please. So, Michael, how are things these days? Things were busy as usual. All right and you? It's been intense for me too. Long hours. I know this feeling. Cheers to the hard work. Cheers. So, do you have any exciting plans for the weekend? Not really, just a little relief. You? I'm thinking of going for a walk on Sunday. It's like great. Where are you going? I'll probably go to the nearby mountains. I also love the open air. Have you been there before? Yes, several times. This is good. I have to check it out sometime. What do you do for fun? I love reading and cooking. All right, and you? I like playing golf and watching sports. Golf sounds interesting. I've never tried. You should give it a chance. Relaxing. Maybe I will. By the way, how is your family? Good, thanks for asking. Is it yours? Mine is great too. Everyone is healthy. That's great to hear. We are lucky. Definitely. Life is full of blessings. Very true. Which is your favorite kitchen? I am a fan of Italian food. You? Mexican cuisine is my first choice. Mexican food can be really delicious. Actually, do you travel often? I try to travel once a year. You? I travel for work so it's quite often. Exploring new places must be exciting. It has some moments but it's tiring. I can guess. Here are our drinks. Cheers. Cheers Mary. For a good friendship and conversation. Definitely Michael. It's always a pleasure. Likewise, Mary. Enjoy your wine. You too Michael. Let's do this more often. Acceptance. Until next time, take care. You too Michael. Good night. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Did you have a good weekend? Yes it was great. I went for a walk with some friends. All right and you? I rested at home and watched some movies. So how is the software project going? It is progressing, but we have some difficulties. We have to meet our deadline. I understand what challenges do we face. We're short of developers and some tasks are taking longer than expected. This is a concern. Let's discuss this at our team meeting tomorrow. Acceptance. Also, the client requested some changes to the user interface. I understand. Can you send me the details so we can review it? Sure. I will email you the updated design documents. Thanks Mary. We'll go through them and see what's possible. It looks like a plan. Is there anything else you want to talk about? A reminder about the upcoming presentation. Have you prepared your slides? Not yet, 
but I'll have it ready by tomorrow afternoon. Great. Let's make sure we're well prepared. Do you have anything else in mind? No, I guess that covers everything for now. See you tomorrow. Okay Mary. I hope you have a productive day, we will talk soon. You too Michael. Goodbye for now. New conversation. How are you? Hello, thank you. I'm fine. How are you? Thanks to you too. How's it going? They are doing well. We are very busy but we manage. Here I am to get exactly what I need. What were you looking for? I needed some t-shirts and a pair of sneakers. Which brand do you prefer? I'm not very picky about the brand, model and comfort are important to me. So would you like to see the new collections? Yes why not? Here you go. Would you like to see this model? Looks good. Does this t-shirt have different colors? Yes, this model is available in both blue and gray. Can I try the gray one? Of course I will get it right away. Thank you. Where are the locker rooms? Here it is. Come on. Thank you. You're welcome. I can help if you need anything else. T-shirt is fine. Now I want to look at sneakers. Certainly. What style of sneakers are you looking for? I am looking for something comfortable and durable for daily use. What's your foot size? Number 42. Would you like to try this model? Yes, this looks good. I want to try. Here you go. Try it. They are very comfortable and also look good. I'll take these sneakers. The perfect choice. Want to look at something else? No for now, thanks. Then we can pay. Can I pay by card? Of course you can pay by card. This is my card. Thank you. I'm getting the second one. Certainly. Your transaction is complete. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Good day to you too. We look forward to seeing you again. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I am good thanks. So let's discuss the software project. What is our progress? Yes, we have completed the first design phase. We are now in the development phase. This is great news. How is the development team doing? They work hard and meet deadlines. We have a dedicated team. Great. Have you encountered any difficulties so far? Yes, we had some compatibility issues but the team quickly resolved them. Good to hear. What's our next milestone? We should finish coding by the end of this month and start testing next month. It looks like a plan. Let's make sure we stay on the right track. I accept Michael. We'll meet again next week for a progress update. Thanks Mary. Have a productive day. You too Michael. Bye. New conversation. Hello teacher. How are you? Hello, I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I am also good thank you. Are you ready for today's lesson? Yes teacher, I'm ready. Great, so let's get started. Of course we can start. Now let's move on to some geometry. What is the sum, in degrees, of the interior angles of a triangle? The sum of the interior angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. Very nice, but what about the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral? The sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degrees. Congratulations, your mastery of geometry is very good. Thank you very much teacher. Geometry lesson over. Now we will study some literature. Which of the works of Nazim Hikmet we read yesterday? 
Yesterday we read the Epic of Forces. Yes, that is right. What do you think about this study? This work was very impressive to me because it is the story of people who love their country and risk everything for it. A very good take. It is important to think so in literature, too. Yes, teacher. I really like Nazim Hikmet's language. Me too. Now let's move on to Turkish grammar. What kind of word is the word, running? New conversation. Good morning Mary. How is everything going? Good morning Michael. Everything is fine, thank you. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Let's discuss the project. Do you have the latest updates? Yes I do. I've made some progress on the front-end design. That's great to hear. Can you show me what you've done so far? I will of course share my screen. Here is the mock-up of the home page. It looks good. I like the color scheme. What about the back-end? Our back-end developer is working on it. They should do an update soon. Great. We have to meet our deadline. Any problems? Not at the moment, but we may need more resources for testing. Okay, I'll discuss this with the team. What about user feedback? We've received some positive feedback on our beta release. This is promising. Let's keep improving it. How is the budget? We are within the budget for now, but we have to follow closely. Acceptance. Let's set up a meeting with the QA team for testing. I'll schedule it tomorrow morning. Perfect. Thanks Mary. Keep up the good work. Thank you Michael. We will keep you informed. New conversation. Hello John. I've finally started college. Really? Great. Which section are you studying? I am studying business management. I am very excited. Congratulations. Business is a great choice. How are the lessons going? So far everything is fine. The lessons of the first semester were quite easy. Nice to hear. What courses are you taking? In the first semester. I take introductory courses in computational mathematics, microeconomics and business. Do you enjoy business classes? Yes, business classes are one of my favorites. The marketing course is very interesting. I also studied business and marketing was my favorite. What other courses will you take? In the second semester, I will choose courses such as finance, management, business ethics. Sound is great. You seem to like college life. Yes, it is really like that. I also made new friends and exploring the campus is fun too. Great. Enjoy your college experience and good luck. Thank you, John. Also, how are you? I'm still working, but I'm thinking of doing a master's degree in the future. Getting a master's degree can be a great idea. What are you doing? I'm thinking of doing a master's degree in education. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine, thanks for asking. What can I bring you today? I'd like a cappuccino and a chocolate croissant, please. Of course, a cappuccino and chocolate croissant comes. Do you want this place or go? I'll take it here, please. I want to enjoy the relaxed atmosphere. Of course, please sit down. Your order will be ready in a short time. Michael prepares cappuccino and croissant. By the way, Michael, have you tried the new pastries here? Not yet. Mary, are they fine? Yes, I tried the almond Danish dish yesterday and it was delicious. Sounds tempting. 
I'll have to try it next time. Here's the cappuccino and chocolate croissant, Mary. Thank you Michael. Looks great. You're welcome. Enjoy. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? I'm thinking of going for a walk on Saturday and maybe watching a movie on Sunday. All right and you? I plan to visit the farmer's market on Saturday and read some books on Sunday. That sounds good. We both have relaxing weekends ahead of us. Definitely. Oh, Michael, can I have the bill, please? Of course, here it is. Your total amount is $8.50. Here is a $10 bill. Save the top as a tip. Thank you very much, Mary. I appreciate it. Have a nice day. You too, Michael. Bye. Goodbye, Mary. Have a nice day. New conversation. Hello, Miriam. How are you today? I'm fine like that, thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. Are you ready for the project meeting? Yes, it is me. Did you complete your role? Almost I just need to review some numbers. Great, let's go over the details together. Sure, the data is here. Perfect. What is the first item on the agenda? We need to discuss the budget allocation. Okay, I have some suggestions on this. Good to hear. Let's hear your ideas. First, we need to devote more resources to marketing. I agree, this is important for our promotion. We should also consider reducing travel costs. This makes sense. We can have more online meetings. Definitely. It is more cost effective. What is the next item on the list? We need to set deadlines for tasks. True, we do not want to lag behind schedule. Let's aim to finish the research by next month. Sounds reasonable. I will update the timeline. Thanks Michael. You are doing a great job. Thanks Mary. Teamwork is very important for success. Definitely. We make a great team. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How are you today? I am good thanks. All right and you? I am also good. Did you sleep well last night? Yes I did. I slept like a baby. That's great to hear. What would you like for breakfast? Let me have some cereal, please. Okay, I'll get it for you. Thank you Michael. You're welcome. Would you like some coffee? Yes please. Black coffee, no sugar. I understand. Did you watch the news yesterday? No, I missed it. What happened? A big fire broke out in the city center. This is terrible. Yes it was. Many people lost their homes. I feel sorry for them. Me too. We should help if we can. Definitely. Here's your cereal and coffee. Thanks again. You're welcome. Enjoy your breakfast. I will do it. What are your plans for today? I have to go to work at 10 o'clock. What time is it? 8. You have some time left. Yes, I do. I'll help with the dishes. You are very kind. Teamwork makes dreams come true. Actually, are you ready for work? Almost I just need to get my bag. Don't forget your lunch. Thanks for packing it for me. No problem. Have a nice day. You too Michael. See you tonight. I'm looking forward to it. Goodbye for now. Bye. Hello Mary. How was your day? Hi Michael. It was busy but fine. That's great to hear. How was your day? It was true. I have had many meetings. Meetings can be tiring. Yes they can. What's for dinner tonight? I was thinking of making pasta. Sounds delicious. I'll start cooking soon. 
Can I help with anything? You can also set the table if you want. Of course I can do that. Thanks Mary. You're welcome. Dinner has been served. This place smells amazing. I'm glad you think so. Let's eat. Enjoy your meal. This pasta is great. I am glad you like it. Did you add some herbs in it? Yes, I added basil and thyme. It gives a good taste. I learned this from my grandmother. He must be a great cook. He. We should invite him sometime. That sounds good. I will call him tomorrow. Thanks Mary. No problem. Do you want some dessert? I'm so full right now. Maybe later. Definitely. How was your weekend Mary? It was comforting. I watched a film. That sounds good. What about you? I went for a walk with some friends. How was the walk? It was challenging but fun. I'm not much a hiker. This is not for everyone. I prefer a quiet day at home. This is fine. What are our plans for the evening? We can watch movies together. It looks like a plan. Which type do you prefer? I like romantic comedies. I can find one for us. Great. I'll make popcorn too. You are thinking of everything. I'm just trying to make it special. You are sweet. I will do my best. The film was very funny. I'm glad you liked it. Thanks for the popcorn too. Anytime. What time is it? It's getting late, around 11 o'clock. I should get some sleep. I will escort you to your room. This is very polite behavior. I'm just looking for you. Good night Michael. Good night Mary. Michael, would you pass me the salt? Of course you are. Thanks. You're welcome. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? Not really, I was thinking of calming down. That sounds good. Maybe we can go for a walk in the park. This is a good idea. I need some fresh air. Perfect. Let's plan for Saturday afternoon. It looks like a plan. What time should we meet? How about 2 in the afternoon? 2 p.m. works for me. See you later. See you on Saturday. Mary, have you ever been to the new cafe downtown? No, I did not. Is it a good thing? I heard it's really beautiful. Would you like to try it with me this weekend? This seems like a fun idea, Michael. What day and time were you thinking of? How about around 3 p.m. on a Sunday afternoon? It works for me at 3 p.m. on a Sunday. I'm looking forward to this. Great. It's a date. Michael, I have exciting news to share. What happened Mary? I got promoted at work today. Wow. That's great news. Congratulations Mary. Thank you very much Michael. I am really happy with that. You worked hard for this and you deserve it. I appreciate your support, Michael. Let's celebrate this weekend. Dinner is on me. Sounds great, Michael. I can't wait. Mary, do you have any plans for summer vacation? Not yet, Michael. I'm still deciding where to go. How about a beach trip? We can relax and sunbathe. This sounds very tempting. Which beach are you considering? There's a very nice one about four hours away. It's called Seaside Beach. Then Seaside Beach is it. Let's plan for July. It's July. I will start looking for a place to stay. Thanks Michael. This will be a great vacation. I can't wait to go to the beach with you, Mary. Michael, it's been a long time since I went to the museum. How about a visit this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. I love art and history. Wonderful. 
We can go on Saturday morning. The museum opens at 10 a.m. It looks like a plan. I'll pick you up at 9 in the morning. Perfect. I will be ready. I look forward to exploring the museum with you. It will be an educational and fun day, Michael. Mary, have you ever tried to cook Italian food? No, I haven't, but I would love to learn. How about an Italian cooking night this weekend? Seems like a fun idea. What Italian dish should we cook? Let's make homemade pizza. It's easy and delicious. Then this is homemade pizza. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I'll bring some wine. Great. It's going to be a delicious evening, Mary. I can't wait to cook and enjoy pizza with you, Michael. Mary, do you have any plans for the long weekend? Not yet, Michael. Do you have any suggestions? How about a day trip to the mountains for some hiking and fresh air? Seems like a great idea. When should we go? The long weekend starts on Friday. We can go on Saturday morning. Saturday morning it is. I will prepare a picnic. It will be an unforgettable day, Mary. I'm excited to explore the mountains with you, Michael. Mary, what kind of music do you like? I enjoy listening to all kinds of music, from pop to classical. That's great to hear. How about going to the concert this weekend? I would love that, Michael. Who is performing? A jazz band plays on Saturday night. Interested? I've always wanted to attend a jazz concert. Count me too. Wonderful. I'll buy the tickets and we can have dinner before the concert. It's going to be a great evening, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy great music with you, Mary. Michael, what do you like to do on a rainy day? I enjoy reading a good book or watching a movie at home. It sounds comfortable. How about we have a movie marathon this weekend? I'm ready for it, Mary. What type of movies do you prefer? How about a mix of comedy and suspense? It looks like a plan. I'll bring some snacks. It's going to be a relaxing day, Michael. I'm looking forward to our movie marathon, Mary. Michael, do you like outdoor activities? Yes I do. I enjoy walking and cycling. Great. Let's go on a bike tour this weekend. I haven't ridden a bike for a while. Where should we go? There is a beautiful path by the river. We can start from there. Looks like a regenerative plan, Mary. What time should we meet? Let's meet at 10 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday morning at 10. I will bring my bike. It will be a fun journey, Michael. I'm excited to hit the road with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to the zoo in our city? No, I haven't been, but I would love to go. How about visiting the zoo this weekend? This seems like a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Saturday works for me. Weather looks good. Saturday it is. I'll get the tickets. I can't wait to see all the animals with you, Michael. It's going to be an exciting day, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking together? I want Mary. This is very funny. How would you like to try making sushi this weekend? Sushi sounds delicious. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the basics. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1700 on Saturday? 5 p.m. works for me. I'm looking forward to this. This is going to be a sushi-making adventure, Michael.
I can't wait to have some sushi with you, Mary. Michael, do you like going to the theater? Yes I do. I enjoy live performances. How about watching a play this weekend? This seems like a great idea, Mary. What is the game about? It's a classic comedy and I've heard it's really funny. Comedy sounds great. What time does the play start? The game starts at 1900 on Saturday. 7 p.m. works for me. I will book the tickets. It's going to be a fun evening, Michael. I'm excited to watch the play with you, Mary. Michael, how about going on a picnic this weekend? Picnic sounds good, Mary. Where should we go? There is a beautiful park with a lake nearby. Perfect for picnic. Looks like a great place. What day should we go? Around 1 p.m. on a Sunday afternoon should be perfect. Sunday at 1300. I'll make some sandwiches. It's going to be a relaxing day at the park, Michael. I'm looking forward to our picnic, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to an art gallery? Yes, I've been to a few. I appreciate the art. How about visiting the art gallery in the city center this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect Saturday morning. The gallery opens at 10 a.m. Saturday at 10 a.m. I look forward to seeing some art with you. It's going to be an inspiring morning, Michael. I look forward to exploring the art gallery with you, Mary. Michael, do you like going to live music concerts? Yes I do. Live music is always a great experience. How about going to a rock concert this weekend? A rock concert sounds exciting, Mary. Who is performing? A local band plays on Saturday night. It should be fun. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be an unforgettable night, Michael. I can't wait to have fun with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits.
It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes, I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes, I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary.
What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael, have you ever tried paddleboarding? No, I didn't, but it looks like fun. How would you like to try it at the lake this weekend? Paddleboarding sounds adventurous, Mary. When should we go? Let's meet at the lake around 11 o'clock on Sunday. Sunday at 11 a.m. I'm excited to try paddleboarding. It's going to be a great day on the water, Michael. I look forward to paddleboarding with you, Mary. Michael, do you enjoy cooking international cuisine? Yes, I do. It's always exciting to try new dishes. How about making Thai curry this weekend? Thai curry sounds delicious, Mary. I've never done it before. It's not very difficult and I can show you the recipe. This looks like a plan. When should I come? How about 1800 on Saturday? 1800 works for me. I can't wait to try the Thai curry. It's going to be a delicious evening, Michael. I can't wait to cook with you and enjoy Thai curry, Mary. Michael, have you ever been to a comedy show? Yes, I have. I love a good laugh. How about going to a comedy club this weekend? Comedy club sounds great, Mary. Who is performing? A famous comedian takes the stage on Saturday night. It must be so funny. Saturday night it is. I'll get the tickets. It's going to be a night of laughter, Michael. I can't wait to enjoy some comedy with you, Mary. Michael, do you like to visit historical places? Yes I do. I find history fascinating. How about going to the historical museum this weekend? That's a great idea, Mary. What day should we go? Perfect on a Saturday afternoon. The museum has amazing exhibits. It's Saturday afternoon. I will be ready. It will be an educational and interesting visit, Michael. I look forward to exploring history with you, Mary. Michael was a great weekend full of fun activities. Yes, it did, Mary. I had a great time with you. Me too, Michael. Let's plan more adventures together. Definitely Mary. I'm looking forward to this. New conversation. Hello Mary. What would you like to watch in the cinema? Hello Michael. I'm thinking of watching a comedy or a romantic movie. Great. So let's pick a romantic comedy. Which movie would you like to watch? I heard, love and laughter, I want to watch it. Okay, shall we get tickets to, love and laughter? Yes please. Would you like a snack before the movie starts? Sure. Let's have popcorn and soda. How big of popcorn should we get? Medium will do the trick, thanks. Okay, I'll have two medium popcorns and two sodas. Thank you Michael. How long until the movie starts? Looks like we still have 10 minutes. Okay, I want to go to the bathroom, can you come too? Of course I have to go too. Better than starting after the cinema. Definitely. Then we must go now. New conversation. Good morning John, how was your weekend? Good morning Mary, it was really beautiful. I spent time with my family. Is it yours? Oh, that's very nice. I had a busy weekend, I had so much to catch up with. Of course, life can be quite hectic at times. Did you get a chance to look at the report I sent you last week? Yes, Mary. Actually, I was going to discuss this with you. 
Oh great, I'd like to get some feedback. Your analysis was impressive, of course, but needs some tweaking. Which part do you think needs improvement? Financial forecasting section. You may want to consider market fluctuations. That makes sense, I'll work on that. In addition, graphical representations can be enhanced for better understanding. I appreciate your honest feedback. Do you have any other suggestions? That should be it for now. How are your other projects going? Pretty good. I'm about to meet the client this afternoon. Well, make sure you have all their requirements. Yes, I have listed them. Thanks for reminding. No problem. How about a coffee break? It would be great. Do you have time now? Yes, let's go to the break room. I needed this break. Working for hours can be tiring. I may relate. It is important that you rest your mind for a while. I totally agree, you know? I'm thinking of starting yoga. This is a good idea. Yoga is a great practice for relaxation. Yes, that's what I heard. Let me know if you need help registering for classes. I will definitely keep that in mind. How about going back to work? Sure. Let's finish today's quests. I agree. See you at the team meeting in an hour. Yes, see you there. Keep up the good work, Mary. Thanks, John. You too. Thanks. Have a productive day. New conversation. Hello. My name is Michael. What is your name? Hi, Michael. My name is Mary. Is this your first time to school? Yes, my first time here. I am very excited. I was very excited at first too, but then I got used to it. What grade are you in? I'm in second grade. What grade are you in? I'm in second grade too. How nice. We are classmates. Really? This is good news. Do you have lunch at school? Yes, my mom told me to have lunch at school. I also eat at school. Food is usually delicious. I also like to eat. What is your favorite food? I love pasta. What about you? I also like pasta, but I like chicken the most. Chicken dish is also very good. Which subject do you like most? I like the painting class the most because it is very colorful and fun. What is your favorite lesson? I also like painting class. But I like Turkish lesson the most. Turkish lesson is also very good. I especially love to listen to fairy tales. I also like to listen to fairy tales. What is your favorite fairy tale? My favorite fairy tale is Little Red Riding Hood. So what's your favorite fairy tale? My favorite fairy tale is Ali Baba and the Forty Thieves. It's a very exciting story. Yes, I love this story too. What do you like to do in the schoolyard? I like playing ball the most all right in you. I also like to play ball. But I like jump rope game the most. I've never tried skipping rope. Then one day I can teach you to jump rope. Really? It would be great. I'm sure it will be a lot of fun. So what do you do after school? I usually do my homework at home and then play a little. I mostly do the same. Maybe we can do the homework together? This is a good idea. Then I'll see you at school tomorrow, Mary. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? Good morning, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Did you find everything you were looking for? Yes, I did. I got all the food I needed for the week. That's great to hear. Have you tried the new bakery section here? Not yet. Is it a good thing? 
Yes, they have delicious pastries and fresh bread. You should try. I will definitely check it out. By the way, have you seen the discounts on canned products? Oh, I didn't notice. Where are you located? They're on the third aisle, right next to the pasta. Thanks for letting me know. I'll get some when I go out. You're welcome. Don't forget to use your loyalty card for extra savings. I never leave home without it. Thanks, Mary. It's okay, Michael. Have a nice day. You too, Mary. Be careful. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How are you today? Hello, Michael. I'm fine like that, thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. Are you ready for our project meeting? Yes, it is me. I prepared the presentation slides. Great. Let's start by discussing our goals for this project. Sure, Michael. Our main goal is to increase sales by 10% in the next quarter. While this may seem ambitious, it can be achieved. What is our strategy? We plan to launch a new marketing campaign and offer discounts to loyal customers. Good idea. Do we have the budget for the marketing campaign? Yes, we allocated $10,000 to the campaign. This should work. Let's also focus on improving customer service acceptance we will train our staff to provide better support great we should meet with the team to discuss these plans in more detail i'll set up a team meeting for tomorrow perfect mary thanks for your hard work you're welcome michael let's make this project a success new conversation hello mary how are you I am good thanks. How are you? I am also good. How was work today? I was very busy but okay. How was your day? Mine went well too. The weather is beautiful so I enjoyed it. Yes, the weather is great. What are you planning to do on the weekend? I don't have a plan yet. What will you do? I'm thinking of going out with my friends. Sounds fun. Which friends will you meet? I'm meeting with Lisa and Jason. Great. I haven't seen them for a long time. Yes, it will be nice to get together. Looks like the bus is late, right? Yes, it looks like that. Here it comes. It's like the bus is full. Finding a place can be difficult. Here is an empty place. Let's sit now. Okay. We're sitting right now. Do you like bus travel? Yes, it is a comfortable and fast journey. Definitely. I go to work by bus every day. I do like that too. I don't want to deal with traffic. You are right. The bus is more comfortable. When do you start work? I start at 9 o'clock. What are your working hours? I also start at 9. Good match. Yes, it's good to start at the same time. Are you satisfied with your current job? Yes, I am satisfied with my job. But I want a little more salary. I understand everyone wants more money. Do you think I should change jobs? Maybe you should look for other opportunities. You're right, I'll think about it. What are you doing this weekend? I'm going on a picnic with my family. How nice. How are the weather forecasts? The weather looks like it will be fine. What will you eat at the picnic? We'll bring sandwiches, fruit and cookies. It looks appetizing. I would also like to participate. Of course you can come too. Thank you. Maybe I'll join you another time. Of course you are always welcome. Here is my stop. Goodbye Mary. Have a nice day. Goodbye Michael. Good day to you too. New conversation. Hi Mary. Did you do your math homework? 
Hi Michael. Yes, I did my homework yesterday. I can share with you. Really? Thank you very much, Mary. I'm stuck on two questions. Of course, what questions can't you solve? Second and fifth questions. I understand in the second question. You must first solve your equations. In the fifth question, you can reach the result by using the division operation. I understand. Let me try again and see. Thank you very much. Any time, Michael. I'm happy to help. Thank you, Maria. You've been really helpful. You're welcome, Michael. Friends should help each other. New conversation. Hello, Mary. Is this seat taken? No, it's free. You can sit here. Thanks. I just missed the previous bus. This is very unfortunate. Yes, I had to run to catch this. I hope you didn't miss anything important. It's just a meeting but it can be rescheduled. Then that's fine. How is your day going by the way? It was intense but nothing out of the ordinary. I understand. Do you take this bus every day? Yes, I commute to work on this. This is convenient. I use it occasionally. Cost effective for me. I should consider taking it more often. You are your property. It's also better for the environment. You are right. I will think about it. Do you have any plans for the evening? Not really, just some errands to get done. Likewise, I need to do grocery shopping. Maybe we should share the car sometime. This is a good idea. It saves money and reduces emissions. I'm glad you think so. Have you watched a good TV show lately? I started a new series on Netflix. Pretty interesting. What is this about? A crime drama set in New York. Sounds interesting. I can check. Let me know if you have and we can discuss. I will do this. Do you have any hobbies? In my spare time I enjoy painting and reading books. This is great. I used to play the guitar, but lately I can't find time. You should get it again if you can. I miss. I'll think about it. Here is my stop. It was nice to chat with you. Same here, Mary. Have a nice day. You too, Michael. Be careful. Bye. Bye. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How are you? I'm fine like that, thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. Did you finish your history lesson homework? No, not yet. I couldn't find the book. No problem. I have an extra copy. I can lend it to you. Oh, that would be great. Thanks, Michael. You're welcome. We can work together later if you want. Seems like a good idea. What time does it work for you? How would you like to be in the library at 1500? Perfect. See you there then. See you, Mary. New conversation. Hi, Mary. How are things going at work? Not bad, Michael. We've been pretty busy lately. All right, and you? I drowned too. But tonight let's relax and enjoy our drinks. Looks like a plan, Michael. What are you drinking? Let me have a beer, please. What about you? I'm going for a glass of red wine. Cheers, Mary. Here is a relaxing evening. Cheers, Michael. So, have you taken any trips recently? Not really, Mary. The job got me hooked. I know this feeling. We should be planning a getaway soon. This sounds like a great idea. Any other suggestions? How about spending the weekend at the beach? Perfect. I love the sound of this. So what are the latest gossip in the office? You know how it is, Mary. Same old, same old. I heard there might be some changes in management. 
Yes, there is talk, but nothing concrete yet. We hope this does not affect us negatively. Acceptance. We've been a good team for years. Speaking of which, do you remember the project we did together last year? Of course, Mary. It was one of our best collaborations. We should do something like this again. Definitely. Let's discuss this in more detail next week. Okay, Michael. I'm looking forward to this. I am also Mary. But for now, let's enjoy our drinks and forget about work. You are absolutely right, Michael. Cheers. New conversation. Hi, Mary. How was your day? It was fine, thanks. I had a few lessons today. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? Not really, maybe I'll study and hang out with my friends. All right, and you? Mary, can you help me with this math problem? Of course, I'd be happy to help. What problem are you stuck on? Michael, haven't you decided on your major yet? Not yet, I'm still exploring different options. All right, and you? What is your industry? Mary, would you like to have lunch together after class? Sounds great, Michael. I'm hungry. Let's go to the campus cafe. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How was your day? Hi, Michael. It was fine, thanks. You? No bad. I spent most of the day in the library. Really? You always seem very busy. What were you studying? I was studying for my math test very difficult. Yes, I know what you mean. I had a hard time in mathematics class last term. Do you have any advice on how I can study effectively? What helped me was solving problems over and over again. I also tried to understand the concepts instead of memorizing the formulas. This looks useful. I focused too much on memorization. Also, don't forget to take a break. It's good for your brain. Are there any books you would recommend? You can try Math Illuminated. It explains the concepts in a simple way. I will check it. Thank you, Mary. It's okay, Michael. Do you have any other lessons today? Yes, I have a history lesson later. Who is your professor? Professor Wilson. Did you hear him? Yes, I took his class last year. He is really passionate about history. Yes, I noticed that too. It makes the lesson more interesting. Definitely. By the way, are you doing anything this weekend? Not really, I'm open to plans. From where? We have a study group in the library. Do you want to join us? It would be great. When does it start? It starts at 2 p.m. We study for two hours, then we take a break. It suits me. I will be there. Great. It will be more fun with you there. Thanks. See you then, Mary. See you later, Michael. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? Good morning, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Are you ready for the software project meeting? Yes, I have prepared all the necessary documents. Great. Let's start by reviewing the project timeline. Certainly. We are on our way to meet the deadline. Good to hear. Any problems with the development team? No, they work efficiently. Communication is seamless. Great. What about the budget? Do you have any concerns? The budget is within the limits we set at the beginning. Perfect. Let's discuss the milestones ahead. The next milestone is scheduled for next week. Are all team members aware of their duties? Yes, I have clearly communicated the responsibilities. Good job, Mary. 
Your leadership makes the difference. Thank you, Michael. Thank you for your support. Now let's talk about potential risks. Have you identified any? There is a slight risk in third party software integration. Let's pay attention to this and make a contingency plan. Acceptance. We should also schedule regular progress meetings. I was thinking the same. Weekly meetings will suffice. This works for me. It ensures that everyone is in harmony. Speaking of compliance, how is our customers' feedback? They are satisfied with the progress made so far. This is great news. Customer satisfaction is our priority. Definitely, Michael. We aim for a successful project delivery. Is there anything else we should be covering today? I think we've covered everything on the agenda. Wonderful. Thank you for your commitment, Mary. Thank you, Michael. Let's continue to work together. Definitely. Let's turn this project into a big success. I could not agree more. Have a nice day. You too, Mary. Until our next meeting. Bye bye, Michael. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? I'm fine. Thanks, Michael. All right, and you? I am good, thanks. Did you find everything you need in the store? Yes, I did. I bought some fruit and vegetables. This is great. I also bought snacks for the office. Speaking of office, how are things going? We've been very busy lately, but we manage. Good to hear. By the way, have you tried the new coffee here? No, I did not. Is it a good thing? Yes, it's really good. You should try. Thanks for advice. Well, have you seen the sales section? Yes, I checked. There are some good deals out there. Great. I'll take a look before I leave. Don't forget to buy bread on the way out. Thanks for reminding me. I almost forgot. No problem. Do you need anything else from here? I think I have everything. Let's go to the safe. Sounds good. I will go first. Of course I will wait for you here. All okay. Now it's your turn. Thanks Mary. I will be fast. Take your time. We'll meet you outside when you're done. New conversation. Hello Mary. How was your day? Hello John. It was a pretty good day. All right and you? Okay, it was a little busy. How is studying going? They are doing well. I had my economics exam today. But I think it went pretty well. What about you? I had a presentation in my marketing class. It was nerve wracking. Oh, I'm sure you did a great job. You always succeed in marketing. Thank you, Sarah. This means a lot. How is your economy? Are you having fun? Yes, I do. Especially the part about market and consumer behavior. And you know, it's really important to understand these concepts in today's world. You're right, understanding economics is beneficial in many ways. Yes, it is really like that. By the way, are you going to the football game this weekend? Yes, I am. I already bought my ticket. Are you coming? Yes, I thought it would be fun. I'm meeting with Emily before the game. Do you want to join us? I would love to. Thank you for your invitation. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How's it going? Hi, Michael. I'm fine like that. Thanks. All right, and you? I am also good. I missed the last bus. Oh, no, that's not good. What will you do now? I will wait for the next one. It should be here soon. It was a relief. Do you mind if I wait with you? Of course not, Mary. You can join me. Thanks, Michael. How was your day? 
It was busy but nothing too crazy. All right and you? It was okay. I had a meeting in the morning. Meetings can be boring sometimes, right? Yes, they can. So what do you do for work? I work in IT. I am a software developer. This sounds interesting. I am a teacher. The teacher needs to be rewarding. Yes, I love working with children. That's great to hear. How do you like to spend your free time? I enjoy reading and walking. All right, and you? I love playing video games and watching movies. This sounds fun. Do you have favorite games? I'm really into adventure games. What about you? I enjoy puzzle games and strategy board games. Great, we should play a game sometime. Sounds like a lot of fun, Michael. Look, the bus has finally arrived. Thank God. Let's get on the ship. After you, Mary. Thanks, Michael. You're so polite. At least I can do that. Let's find a seat. Sounds good. I hope we can chat more on the way. I am also Mary. It will make driving more enjoyable. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? I'm fine. Thank you, Michael. And you? Not bad, thanks. Have you been busy lately? Yes, work keeps me busy. All right, and you? There is much to do here as well. Shall we have a coffee? Sure, that sounds great. Do you prefer black or cream? Black, please. And maybe even a pastry. I'll have a latte with a croissant. How is the project going? It's slow progress, but we're getting there. Are there any problems on your end? No major issues, just minor glitches. We will manage. Good to hear. What's new in your department? We are starting a new campaign next week. Exciting times. This sounds interesting. I will pay attention to this. How is your family, Michael? Good, thanks for asking. What about yours? Everyone is fine, thanks. Are you still planning that trip? Yes, but pending for now. Work, you know? I understand we'll catch up soon though. Definitely Mary. Let's enjoy our coffee today. I accept Michael. It's always nice to chat with you. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, Michael. How are you today? I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Are you ready for our project meeting? Yes, it is me. Let's start. Great. First, let's review the project timeline. Certainly. I think we need to set clear milestones. I agree. How about starting with the design phase? Sounds good. Who will be responsible for this? I think Sarah can handle the design. Experienced. Acceptance. What is the deadline for the design phase? Let's aim for two weeks from today. This is reasonable. Next we need to code the software. Right. I will take care of that part. Perfect. We'll have to test it thoroughly after that. Yes, testing is very important. I will coordinate the testing phase. Good morning my baby. Let's also make sure you document the code. Certainly, documentation is required for future reference. What about the overall project delivery date? I think we can complete it in two months. This works for me. We should hold regular status meetings. Acceptance. How about every Friday at 10 a.m.? This works for me. Is there anything else we should discuss? We should also consider the budget of this project. Right. Let's be mindful of our spending. I will create a budget table for this. Thanks Mary. You are very organized.
It's all about staying on track. Another thing? I can't think of anything else for now. Let's not cool off. Definitely. Thanks Michael for the productive meeting. Thank you Mary. Have a nice day. You too Michael. Goodbye for now. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How was your commute to work? It was pretty smooth, thanks. What about yours? Same way. I have room on the train for once. Good to hear. Are there any important developments regarding the project? Yes really. Greenway Corp. He approved our offer. This is great. When do we expect to start working on this? They want to kick things off next week. Next week? This is a little early. Hmm. Did they provide the necessary details and data? Yes, I received an email with all the necessary details and I will review it today. Okay, make sure we fully understand all your requirements so that we can plan properly. Of course Jane. I'll go through the email meticulously. Good morning my baby. How is Smith's project? Any progress? Smith's project is progressing well. They like our design concept and are ready for development. Wonderful. Let me know about both projects. Definitely. New conversation. Oh, hello Mary. How have you been? Hello Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I've been busy with work lately. I can guess. What are you shopping for today? Just some food. I need milk and bread. Same way. I also need eggs and vegetables. Let's buy a car and shop together. Great idea Michael. Do you prefer white bread or whole wheat bread? I like whole wheat. Healthier. You are right. I'll take whole wheat, too. Do you need any fruit? Yes, some apples and bananas please. I'll have oranges and grapes. How about some snacks? Maybe a bag of chips for movie night. Sounds fun. Let's get some chips. Don't forget the salsa sauce. Got it, Mary. Salsa sauce is a must. Michael, have you tried this new cereal brand? No, is it okay? Yes, it is delicious and healthy. Then I'll give it a try. What about drinks, Michael? I'll have some orange juice and water. I need some iced tea and lemonade. Let's not forget the coffee. Oh right, I can't start the day without it. Neither can I, Mary. Michael, do you need anything from the frozen section? Maybe some frozen pizza for a quick dinner. Good choice. I'll have some ice cream for dessert. Perfect. Ice cream is my weakness. Me too, Michael. Mary, let's go to the vault now. I admit, we have everything we need. It was nice shopping together, Mary. Yes it was, Michael. We should do this more often. Definitely Mary. Be careful. You too Michael. Bye. New conversation. Hello Mary. How are you? Hi Michael. I'm fine. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine too. Thank you very much. You were not at school yesterday. Why did you come? Yes, I was sick. I went to the doctor and he told me I need some rest. Get well soon, Michael. Are you feeling better today? Yes, I am much better. Thank you. When will I be able to play football again? My doctor said I could play again after a few days of rest. So let's plan to play soccer in the park for the weekend. Great idea Mary. See you this weekend. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How are you? I'm fine like that, thanks. All right and you? I'm fine too, thanks for asking. 
Did you have a good weekend? Yes, I did. I went for a walk with some friends. This sounds fun. I got some relief at home. Sometimes a relaxing weekend is best. Definitely. Hey, do you have the notes from yesterday's lecture? Yes, I do. I can send these to you later. Thanks. This will be very helpful. No problem. Are you ready for the test on Friday? Not really. I need to work harder. If you want, we can study together. It would be great. Shall we meet at the library tomorrow? Sure. What time does it work for you? How about three in the afternoon? Perfect. See you then. Thanks, Mary. You are a lifesaver. You're welcome, Michael. We are in this together. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, Michael. How are you today? I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine too, thanks for asking. Did you find everything you need? Yes, I did. I bought some bread, milk, and eggs. Sounds great. I need to buy some fruit and vegetables. Let's go to the production section together. I need some apples. Of course, I need oranges. They're on sale today. Really? I can have some too. Here they are. They look fresh. I will take a few of these. How about these bananas? These look mature. I'll take some too. Do you need tomatoes or cucumbers? Yes, I do. Let's get some. Okay, we have everything in the production section. What's next? I need some pasta and pasta sauce. Do you like spaghetti? Spaghetti sounds good. Let's find the pasta aisle. Here it is. Which pasta shape do you prefer? I like spaghetti or penne. What about you? I'm going with penne today. Now we need some sauce. I see some tomato sauce and alfredo sauce. Which one do you prefer? I'll go with tomato sauce. It is more versatile. Okay, let's get some tomato sauce then. What else is on your list? I need some rice and beans for the recipe. The rice is right here. Do you prefer white rice or brown rice? I prefer brown rice because of its health benefits. Good choice. Let's get some brown rice. Do you need black beans or kidney beans for your beans? This time I will go with kidney beans. Great. You have everything on your list. Do you need anything else? Just some toilet paper and dish soap. These are in the hallway of the house. Follow me. Thank you, Michael. You have been a great shopping partner. No problem, Mary. It's always nice to catch up while shopping. I agree. Let's go and pay for our food. It looks like a plan. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How are you today? Hello, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine, thanks for asking. Are you here to do some shopping? Yes, I need to get some food. What about you? I'm going to grab a few things for dinner tonight. Do you have dinner plans? Not exactly. I was thinking of making spaghetti. All right, and you? It sounds so delicious. I can make some grilled chicken. Would you like to join me for dinner? Sounds great. I'd love to. When should I come? How about 7 p.m.? Is this suitable for you? Perfect. 7 p.m. works for me. See you then, Michael. Great. I'm looking forward to it. Good day, Mary. You too, Michael. See you tonight. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? I'm fine, Michael. Thanks for asking. All right, and you? I am also good. Did you have a chance to review the project proposal? Yes, I did. It looks promising, but there are some concerns. 
I understand. What specific concerns do you have? First of all, the timeline seems a bit cramped. Can we extend it for a week? This is a valid point. I'll check with my team to see if that's possible. Thanks a lot. I also noticed that some details were missing from the budget. Could you please indicate what is missing so we can fix the problem? We also need to include software licenses and training costs. I understand I will have them added. Another thing? Yes, I think we should involve the QA team earlier in the process. This is a good suggestion. I will talk to them about this. Thanks Michael. The key to a successful project is collaboration. Definitely Mary. Teamwork makes dreams come true. So when do you want to schedule the kickoff meeting? Let's aim for next Monday. Is this suitable for you? Monday is perfect. I will send the invitations. Thanks Mary. I appreciate your input. It's okay, Michael. We are in this together. That's the spirit. Let's make this project a success. I accept Michael. Have a nice day. You too, Mary. Be careful. Bye. New conversation. Good morning Mary. Good morning Michael. How are you today? I feel a little tired. I had a long day at work. I understand sometimes it can be difficult. Yes definitely. But I'm here to work and feel better. That's the spirit. Let's start with some warm-up exercises. Sounds good. What should we start with? We can start with some stretching. Reach your toes. Like this? Yes, just like that. Hold for 10 seconds. Okay, that's a nice feeling. Great. Now let's do some jumping moves to get our heart rate up. Jumping jack. Got it. One, two, three, go. Wow, that's already a workout. It certainly is. Now let's move on to the treadmill. I don't really like running, but okay. We don't need to run fast, just a light jog to start. Okay, let's do it. How about running for 15 minutes? Seems manageable. Let's go. They run for 15 minutes on the treadmill. Good job, Michael. You are doing great. Thanks, Mary. I'm starting to feel better already. That's the magic of exercise. It boosts your mood. You are right. I should come to the gym more often. It is definitely good for your health and well-being. I will keep it in mind. Thanks for the training, Mary. You're welcome, Michael. See you next time. New conversation. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, Michael. How are you today? I am good, thanks. And you? I'm fine, thanks for asking. Did you have a good weekend? Yes, I did. I watched a movie. Which film did you watch? I watched a comedy called, Hangover. Did you see before? No, I did not. Was it funny? Yes, it was very funny. Don't watch him. I will check it. By the way, where is our next lesson? I think it's in room 302. When does it start? It starts at 10 a.m. Do you have your textbooks with you? Yes, they are here. Did you do today's homework? No, I didn't have time last night. You should try doing this tonight. Thanks for reminding me. Are you ready for the test on Friday? I need to work more for this. Would you like to work together later? Seems like a good idea. What's your trade, Mary? I specialize in psychology. All right, and you? I'm studying computer science. What do you like most about psychology? I find the human mind fascinating. What about computer science? I enjoy solving problems and coding. 
Are you going to the football game on Saturday? I'm not a big fan of the sport, so I probably am not. What about you? I will be there with some friends. Do you like American food? Yes, I love burgers and fries. All right, and you? I prefer Italian food like pizza and pasta. Have you been to a good restaurant recently? I tried a new Mexican restaurant last week. It was really good. You should go sometime. I will keep it in mind. Well, it's time for class. See you later, Michael. Goodbye, Mary. Have a nice day. New conversation. Hello, Mary. How is it going? Hi, Michael. Not bad, thanks. All right, and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. What classes are you taking this semester? I'm taking English 101 and Date 203. All right, and you? I'm in Math 105 and Chemistry 201. Are you satisfied with the lessons? English is great but history is a bit boring. All right, and you? Math is hard but chemistry is interesting. Do you have any plans for the weekend? Not really, just a little study. All right, and you? I'm thinking of going to the movies with some of my friends. Do you want to join us? Thanks for the invitation, but I have to finish an assignment. Maybe another time. It's okay. Maybe next weekend then. What do you like to do in your spare time? I love reading books and going for walks. All right, and you? I love playing video games and watching sports events. Do you have any siblings? Yes, I have a younger brother. He's in high school. All right, and you? I have an older sister who works as a nurse. Do you like living on campus? Convenient but sometimes noisy. All right, and you? I live in an apartment off campus. Quieter but I need to commute. What is your industry? I am studying English literature. All right, and you? I'm studying engineering. Difficult but interesting. Which is your favorite book? I love To Kill a Mockingbird. All right, and you? I'm a fan of The Great Gatsby. Have you traveled abroad? No, not yet. I hope to travel after graduation. Have you ever been abroad? Yes, I studied in Europe for a period. It was an incredible experience. Do you have a pet? I have a cat named Mustache. Do you like animals? Yes, I have a dog named Buddy. Pets are great companions. Do you like to cook? I'm not very good at this, but I'm trying. All right, and you? I can make great spaghetti. Would you like to have dinner together sometime? Sounds fun, of course. Let's plan.